Hi everyone and welcome to the channel. In this tutorial video for the RadioMaster MT12 Surface Radio, we're going to look at battery calibration. Now I have checked this and my battery calibration was perfect. That means you take a multimeter, you check the battery that you're running your radio on, and then you turn the radio on and look on the front of the screen and see if it matches. Now, it, it is very accurate, but I just want you to show you how to do this, just in case you came up with a problem, and I will show you how to make the adjustments if you need to. So let's switch over to the MT12 and I'll show you how to do this. Now let's take a look at this. It's going to be a little bit tricky for me to film, so I'm going to turn the radio off. Receiver still connected. Okay, I'm just going to go and enter. Force it to disconnect. Right, so I'm going to take the base off. Now, what you would need to do is you need to measure the battery voltage. Now I can't do this and hold. Well, and be careful that you don't short out your radio. So all I would do is attach the probes for my multimeter here and I'll take the reading. Now it is a good idea I'm going to turn the radio back on and to take the reading while the batteries are under load. So turn it on you put the probes here you test the voltage. Now you're asking where do we put the figures so once we've got our figure we are going to put that figure into our battery. So it's, it's, see it's saying 7.9 now I've had the radio on a bit since I did the check the check of the battery voltage. Now, if we go into the system button and we go across until we get to the hardware and we scroll up and keep going up or down, whichever way you want to go, and we come to the battery voltage. Now, if your battery said 7.9, you know you're good to go because that's what it stated there. But if you will need to change it, you click and just dial in the correct figure, whichever figure you need to put in there. Now, in all the years that I've been using Radio Master radios, I have never had to adjust this, but it was just a video I wanted to put out there, so if you needed to, you would know how to do it. Thanks for watching this video, and if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. And if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. Happy driving. Bye for now.